Welcome cuties to our channel. Oh my and god, this is my side. This is my favorite side. Whatever, bitch. So welcome to our channel, cuties. And right now we're not in Seoul, but guess where guess we're, we're at? at? We're yeah. in Jeju Island. Woohoo! The main reason why we came here is to see a potential land for our future cafe. Yeah. So you could know that we're like contemplating whether we should put on Seoul or Jeju. Yeah. But Mama Kiki actually has a land in Jeju yeah. Island, which and is like literally like there's weed growing. Like yeah. no one is using this land. I will show you guys. Like it's really a hot mess right there because <laughs> like nobody took care of it. Yeah. And also we kind of wanted to take this opportunity to create some healing blocks since our kids love healing blocks. Yes. And we also wanted to kind of use this time to release our stress and get out from Seoul and have some peaceful time with Mama Kiki in Jeju. Yeah. Yeah, so we rented a car, obviously. Yeah. When you're in Cheju Island, you need to rent a car. Yeah. There's no way you can. There's no subway here, so yeah. So this is somebody else's land. Look at that green. It looks so tidy like, and like. Well care. Yeah. But and you just want to see our land? Okay, here you go. <laughs> I think it's been about one year that we came here. Yeah, about a year. Yeah. This stuff that is growing is almost the same as my height. <laughs> Yeah, so this is the land, cuties. Like, nobody took care of it. Look, look at Mama. She's, like, so stressed right now. Yeah, Mama Cook is like, oh, shit. <laughs> What's going on? At that time, it wasn't this high. Yeah. So we were able to go in and walk. But, like, it's huge, right? It's, like, this whole thing. But, like, imagine, like, clearing this land and getting it, like, fixed so that you have, like, water system, electricity system all going. Mama Kiki, what do you think of the land? <laughs> I'm so sad. Why? Nobody care. <laughs> there used to be horses here too. And they poo a lot. <laughs> I kind of miss those horses. There were two of them. But I think the owner sold it because that owner got another job. Look at their eyes. <laughs> what is up cutie? So right now we're heading to a cafe called Honeymoon House. And basically this cafe was actually a hotel in the 80s and 90s. It was actually really popular but obviously it's no longer popular so they kind of renovated it into a cafe and they say this cafe has one of the best views in Jeju so I'm really excited. And there's actually like a waterfall very near here so after the cafe we're gonna go to that waterfall. So let's go cuties! I'm so excited. So already like this entrance looks like a hotel entrance. It kind of looks like LA. Yeah, it doesn't look like Korea. Yeah. Oh, this area is so pretty. Whoa. It's like we're, we came to like a really luxurious hotel. I need to pay. Oh.
Come here, come here. The portion is crazy. Really? Whoa. So huge. Wow. So here's our chocolate chip cookie. Cafe latte in ice. And Mama Kikyu is cafe latte hot. Here you go, Mama Kikyu. Mm -hmm. Thank you. She is busy with her phone. Yep. Why did you come to change it when you're gonna do your phone, Mom? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Taste this. Full of butter. Mm -hmm. It could have been great if they warm it up, yeah. right? Mm. Let's try this. Mm -hmm. mm. Whoa. Wow, it's really good. Whoa. Wow, it's very roasty. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I'm very mentally disturbed right now. <laughs> <laughs> this cafe is running really well. Yeah. The business is booming right now here. The chefs are so busy right now. Mm -hmm. I hope our cafe will be like this too. Yeah, it will be. There's but so many customers. Strength point of this cafe is the view. view. Right in front of uh, this ocean. Yeah. This is our view. And they actually have a sit over there too. By the way, sis, can you please stop sleeping inside the car? <laughs> I'm really bored. I'm sorry. She was like, literally like this. <laughs> and then whenever I like, I go to that sweet bump, you're like. I need some sleep. I'm the doggy. <laughs> okay, Judy, so our next destination is Camellia Arboretum. Basically a huge ass garden where there's a bunch of like camellias and other beautiful flowers and plants. So we arrived. Mm -hmm. well, this is Got the, the ticket. This is the entrance. Oh, I already cool. smell it. Yo, the car smells like corn. What? The car smells like corn. Oh yeah, it does. Oh sis, you look so beautiful. A pretty girl smelling that. Okay. That's it's like so all pink. pink. So pretty. Where? Where is she going? Is that even a Can way to go? go there? No, I don't think so. What is she doing? I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> she does everything to take a photo. She just... <laughs> Look how pretty these flowers are.
I do. Yes, it is. So I was gonna wake up at 6 a.m. <laughs> so I did the alarm at 6, but guess when we woke up? 9.30. Hey, at least I woke up and turned off the alarm. By the way, a lot of cuties from our past videos asked us, where's this two sets from? It's from Reebok. It's from Reebok. By the way, cutie, this is our hotel. It's called Jeju Xinhua World. And this is the place where there's a G Dragons Cafe. Yeah, the second cafe which we went yeah. last time that has a huge flower, flower. top. Yeah. I was like, wait, this place looks really familiar. Yeah. There's a pool right outside there. Oh, this is a pool? Yeah. Whoops. It's an outdoor pool, but obviously it's too cold right now. Yeah. Okay, I'm hungry. <laughs> We're gonna go to this place called Grumpy Baby. It's a brunch place where they sell burgers. And surprisingly, I didn't like intentionally found this place, but I didn't intentionally found it. But then this place actually sells vegan burgers too. <gasps> oh my god! So just FYI cuties, um, we are no longer vegetarian. Mm -hmm. We actually transitioned about like two months ago. So we started off with a little bit of like seafoods and then we do eat a little bit of meats now. This whole thing happened because some health issues like Eugene is going through, but we won't go detail about it. But yeah, but that doesn't mean we are changed in person. We're still the same. It's just our diets changed a little bit. Yeah, I just wanted to let our cuties know. Go. I'm hungry. Okay, let's go. The weather is gorgeous, but then it's a little bit windy today. Oh well. We're here, cuties. Oh my god, this place is so pretty. I was first uh, really drawn to this place because the place is like pink, pink. Anything pink, you gotta go. Go in. Yeah, you gotta go and check. <laughs> let's go, be. Yep. Okay, let's go in. Look out, here she comes The woman that I love It's too bad she'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone so This is the menu and they literally have a grumpy baby here <laughs> So cute yeah. So this is like a straight up yeah. brunch I'm a vegan friendly they have like vegan sausage breakfast, vegan, vegan tofu, tofu, vegan, vegan burger, buttermilk pancake. Mm. Wow, mm. chili cheese steak sandwich. Oh my god. <laughs> I always want to try vegan sausage. <laughs> Mom is taking way too long to make decisions. <laughs> <laughs> The broccoli cheese soup. How is it? It's really good. With the cracker. <laughs> We've never tried vegan sausage. No. Okay, cuties. Oh my gosh. So the owner is actually really fluent in English, and I think she has a little bit of Australian accent. So she does. She, yeah. So maybe yeah. she's from Australia. But she was so kind enough to give us a cookie for free. This is a vegan cookie. It is hella, hella heavy. They call it a monster cookie. Yeah. So we were kind of like talking about like vegan and like you know how we were like vegan and how hard it is to be vegan in Korea. And then she was like, "Do you guys know that there's actually a map of vegan places in Jeju?" 
Hill. And I have it right here. It lists out all the 32 places of restaurant in Jeju where they serve vegan options. As well as six bakery shops in Jeju that serves vegan bakeries. We'll le leave this map in the description box below. So if there's any cuties who are planning to visit Jeju anytime soon and is struggling with vegan food in Jeju, please look at this map. Okay, taste us. Whoa. Oh. No. Super chunky, gooey. Oh my god. And a coffee. She's thick. Thick. We're actually at this cafe called One and Only. But the place is so crowded. I don't think they should do that. I fear for my life, so we yeah. came here. And we can go outside and drink it, but today is so windy. windy. Like my hair's like <laughs> My hair becomes like this when I go out. You're here. Okay, so basically you can choose your own favorite tea. Wow. I don't wanna fall. Close my eyes, not pretend at all. I don't want to start Every day looking out in love Oh my god, be careful <gasps> Wow, what is this? <gasps> Look at that, that is so cute So this is the halabong tea It's a halabong tea yeah. and, then you go. and this is the number 6070 that we did Here's oh. the cup Oh my god That's so cute Mm. That's like a strawberry cherry tea, right? You can put it with a syrup <gasps> with cinnamon. Oh my god. That's so that's so that's oh, we're so, so, so. Mm. 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 so good. I love how every drink has different character. Yeah. Right? Mm. Ooh, the cinnamon smells so strong. I think I put too much cinnamon. Yes. <laughs> Sensei, please teach me. <laughs> they gave us a little like treat. Oh my goodness. I feel so fancy. So as you can see, cutie, there's so many books here because those are all kind of like a travel books that you can actually purchase from here. So I believe like the owner here travels a lot yes, and she yes. collects like teas and teacups. So it's very <coughs> personalized cafe. I really love it. And obviously the display is amazing. And yeah, this place has a lot of variety of teas and you can actually choose the, the tea, tea you that want. you want from like, I think there was like over 50 selections of teas. Uh -huh. That's how we got this one, the cherry, yeah. cherry taste. We find ourselves after airplane store close and wheels touch the heavens. We discover the maps to our hearts when we lose the maps to this world. Wander and find home in the people you meet. Wander and find home inside yourself. We look like a mess. My hair's quite greasy. We're back to our sister. That trip went way too fast. Yes. <laughs>
<laughs> I would actually I'll would love to stay in Jeju for like a month. <gasps> yeah. That would be really fun. So about the location of our cafe. Yeah. Before this trip, Mama Kikyu and us had a really small hope for that place to being a potential future location for our cafe. Yes, because when we went there last year, it was really like everything was undeveloped. There yeah. was like nothing around that yeah. place. Just, there was just like horses and like, you know. Straight up nature, yeah. like even the way you go in, we had to like it was so <laughs> narrow, like. But then when we went this, this time, time yeah. they actually made like a new road beside our field. There's actually like houses building. I, I think it's gonna be like some kind of like um guest red, house, yeah, guest house or something. something. They're starting to make this barrier and stuff, and like it got so good. It just overall everything got very developed. Yeah. So we're like, oh, oh my, my goodness, God. this place is gonna get populated. And with then people. just like few blocks away from our cafe was some kind of like really gorgeous townhouse community area mm. that kind of looked like Greece or something. I'm like, <gasps> God, this place has a potential. So by the time when we're gonna make our cafe, that place is gonna. Yeah, like, yeah, that place has a lot of potential because around there, there's no cafes. Yeah, this place is becoming. Oh my god! If we think about long run, yeah. I want to make cafe in Jeju Island, and then if it gets good, we can make a chain in Seoul. Seoul is like so competitive. Yeah, there's so many other great cafes, and yeah. if we become among the one, it's gonna be like more competition. Yeah, and I want cuties to feel more of that nature, nature. when we they come to our cafe, but I don't think that's possible when we do in Seoul because yeah. like Seoul, Seoul is so is polluted. polluted. Yeah, we want our cuties to have the healing moment when mm. you come to our cafe and I think Jeju is like the perfect, perfect. place for us to put yes. that cafe we'll keep you cuties yeah. updated let us know about your opinion cuties we'll definitely document all the process mm. you know show all the process and go along with our cuties yes just like we did yeah. for this Jeju trip yeah. right oh by the way cuties Oh, there's exciting news. Mm -hmm. On December the 8th at 10 p.m. KST, mm -hmm. we're gonna hold our very, very first YouTube, YouTube live. live. It's gonna be our first live with Farfetch, mm -hmm. and we're basically gonna be showing like, you how to style. style. And we're gonna unbox some like fashion items, mm -hmm. so it's gonna be super fun. Yeah, yes. and there's gonna be another huge Farfetch <laughs> discount code for our cuties if you cuties haven't got any gift for Christmas. Yes. So, yeah, yeah. and that coupon is only available during our live, live. for yeah. 24 hours so yes. make sure to stop by at our live it's december 8th 10 p.m kst yeah korea time yeah. so it's gonna be different for you your cuties wherever you are yeah. so make sure to check it out cuties yes. we'll put all the details <gasps> in the description box below so make sure to check it out yes. and yeah. we'll see you guys in our next video bye, -bye. bye, -bye.